Do you often get overwhelmed by the amount of terminologies we encounter as a veterinary student? While shaping ourselves into the perfect veterinarian we dream of, having a good hold on terminology definitely goes a long way. So without any further delay, let's together brush up our veterinary vocabulary. Hi, I am Muskan Maudgil, a second year veterinary student and you're watching Pet Space. We'll be discussing 10 different terminologies today and it'll be great if you comment down below at the end and let me know how many did you get right. So, the hint for the first word is, if the animal is suffering from labored or difficult breathing, what is it called? That's dyspnea. Moving on to word 2. The animal has just parturated yet there is a failure of milk secretion. That's agalexia. Agalexia could be due to a variety of systemic diseases, infections or even if the memory glands are not well developed. That's two words down but let's see if you can guess this one. The hint for the third word is a condition often seen in poultry wherein the neck is twisted or turned to one side. That's Torricollis. Torricollis is often seen in poultry suffering from the bacterial foul cholera or the viral Ranikhet disease. Let's move on to word 4. Any inanimate object or material that is most likely to carry the infections. For example, the furniture, the utensils, etc. That is called a fomite. Word number 5. Any abnormal behavior or as we can term it as bad habit acquired by the animal that can affect its performance. Those are called vices. The examples may include wind sucking in horses and eye rolling and tongue rolling in cattle etc. Next we have what is it called when the animal consumes its own feces. That's called coprophagy. While coprophagy is totally a normal physiological process for rabbits wherein they start eating their soft feces at about 3 weeks of age, it's a vice in cattle, dog etc. For word number 7 we have what is a chicken that's raised and bred specifically for meat production? Those are called broilers. Ideally in India, broilers are often marketed from 6 to 8 weeks of age. Moving on to word number 8. What is it called when there is partial or complete loss of hair in patches in the regions where they are normally bound to present? That's alopecia. Alopecia could be due to various parasitic infestations or it can simply be a metabolic disorder. Now for word number 9. What are the first feces excreted by a newly born offspring called? That's meconium. Finally for the 10th term. We have what is the condition called when the animal has a loss of appetite or doesn't feel like eating? That's anorexia. That was all for the video guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my content, please make sure to like, subscribe and comment down below how many terms did you get right. Thank you.